Hey everybody, welcome to Heat My Shorts. Got another one for you today. I couldn't decide whether to do the pod video or a snack review for you today, so you're getting both. My apology if that bothers you. I'm sure it doesn't. Um, so we have another bag of pretzels from Hanover, uh, Snyder's of Hanover, my apology. These are the cheddar cheese flavored ones. Um, Robert B said that he loves these ones. In the previous video I asked what other flavors people were into and uh, he said he also digs the buffalo flavor and Kevin K was asking about the jalapeno flavor so we're gonna have to review those ones as well I guess thank you for the input fellas I really appreciate that one so today as I said we're doing the cheddar cheese variety a little bit of a glare from the light back there but there we go we can see it there so I'll read you a little bit of what's going on with the bag here bursting with flavor naturally flavored sourdough hard pretzel pieces America's Pretzel Bakery since 1909. Wow, bursting with flavor. The perfect way to describe the delicious Snyder of Hanover pretzel pieces. Generous chunks of our sourdough hard pretzels deliver the yum of cheddar cheese. You'll love the crunch, hearty satisfaction, and cheesy flavor found in each and every bite. Lots of glare going on there. <laughs> Starting with a century-old family recipe and only the finest ingredients, each, each pretzel is slow-baked to perfection. Read you the ingredients here. Try to keep an eye on the glare so I'm not blinding you with that. The ingredients are enriched flour, and I'm not going to read all the fine print on the enriched flour. Then we have palm oil, whey, cheddar cheese, salt, maltodextrin, buttermilk powder, yeast, onion powder, disodium phosphate, sodium cassinate, dehydrated tomato, citric acid, spice, skim milk, sugar, natural flavor, autolyzed yeast extract, garlic powder, turmeric extract, Anato extract. That was in another one recently, and I didn't research it even. I need to look it up now after this review. <laughs> Paprika extract. Disodium inosinate. Inosinate? Inosinate. That must be correct. I don't know. I don't know what that is either. There's a few things in here. I'm not going to research, I guess. Disodium guanylate and sodium hydroxide. Contains wheat and milk. Let's open these up. Hope you're all having a great day today. Got a lot done today. Didn't get too badly burnt up from those two chocolate habaneros this morning, which is nice. Didn't have any cap cramps or anything from that. So I'll show you what's going on in this bag. You can see all the delicious, cheesy pretzel chunks in there. Oh yeah, some of them are quite coated. Let's see if I can set this down so I can show you these. Come on. There we go. You can see all the flavoring on that. It's just coated. So, from Snyder's of Hanover, these are their cheddar cheese pretzels. Heat my shorts. Oh, that's a cool effect. Mmm. <laughs> These are really good. Great cheddar flavor. Powdered cheddar, that dehydrated cheddar. Definitely getting the garlic and onion. Mmm. It's been a while since I had this flavor. It's really good. Really tasty. Every piece is just, just coated. You can see it's sticking to my fingers a little bit, unfortunately, but we'll clean that up. <laughs> it's too bad there's garlic and onion on this, otherwise I'd be able to share them with Maggie. I'm sure she'd love that. It's probably a uh, minuscule, minuscule enough amount that it probably wouldn't hurt her, but I'm not risking it. She's our baby. Mm-hmm. You're 
right rubber bee. These are great. Great cheddar flavor. See what I did there? That was a claw for you, Robert. Okay, we'll have one more. A little bit less. See, they missed a spot on this one. A little bit might have broken there, I guess, after they coated it. Don't judge me. I washed my hands before I started. I like these a lot. I'm going to do a quick, quick hangout with Maggie here. Actually, maybe I'll just put them here. Tilt the camera down. Let's see here. Have a quick hangout with Maggie. I'm going to keep this video relatively short. Where's the doggie? Where's the doggie? Hey, Maggie. A little bit of a mess of cords and whatnot behind me. Yeah, a little bit more. Some belly rubs from the family. Yeah. Tony Reeves belly rub. Charlie Mullins belly rub. Debbie Bartram belly rub. Yeah. All your buddies. You good girl? More? See how needy she is? She'll do this all day. She'll just keep... Can you see that on the camera? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, she'll just keep doing that all day. Yeah. <laughs> but anyways, the funny thing is that I will keep petting her all day too and end up getting nothing done as a result of that. Okay, I'll have one more of these. They're good. These are good. first time I've had them, but it's been a long time. So anyways, I'm going to close them up now. Thank you all for taking the time to hang out with us here. Really appreciate it. Keeps me making these videos. So keep it up. Keep coming around. Keep handing out those likes, commenting down below. Spread the word. Having a great time doing this. And uh, we're going to keep it up. I'm not going to be doing, doing two a day from now on again. I'm not, not doing that. She's making funny noises. Trying to get attention. Um, keep it at basically one a day. Unless we're doing meetings or challenges and stuff like that. Pods. I don't know. I'm kind of up in the air of whether pods should be um, the video of the day. Or if that's like a bonus thing. I don't know. I'm still figuring this out. Like I said this morning. I'm still new to this. Still figuring out how to do this. Still learning the ropes. So bear with me. And thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. Or as somebody else put it, from my whole heart. Not the, just the bottom of my heart. I remember who said that. I really liked it though. Anyways, I love you all. Have a great day or night or evening or whatever time of the day it is when you see this. I appreciate you. Really do. Take care everyone. This has been Heat My Shorts with Maggie and Steve. Snyder's of Hanover. Cheddar cheese pretzels. Get them. You gotta try them. They're delicious. Bye-bye.